Hi, I'm Jonathan J. Reinhardt from Wargaming Recon, and today we're looking at the Cavern's Deep Cave Door Pack from Dwarven Forge's Cavern's Deep line. As you can see here, you get a variety of door pieces that go perfectly with your Cavern's Deep pieces from Dwarven Forge, and also work with your Cavern's pieces from the second Kickstarter they've done. You can see that you get two regular doors, they open one way, the nice wooden feature, they're actually movable, great texture on them, really neat looking, great for a primitive society, or just about anything else. You have this nice archway with stalactites, <laughs> stalactites sorry, coming down, and there's a nice slot in there that has a variety of pieces you can put in, including this slime piece, just slides right in, and it actually has some segments on the side that allow you to kind of lock it in different levels, so you can have the slime coming down, semi-transparent, so you can get some light coming through it. You have this nice boarded up area that allows you to completely segment off a section. Maybe it's something your characters have to get through. Maybe it's something that can't be gotten through. You have this portcullis here, which is really cool. I like this. This could be useful for a variety of fantasy and historical and all sorts of wargaming there as well, not just role-playing games. And then these are my favorite. You get two of these in here. These are hidden cave doors, or secret cave doors. And they look like a wall, but it swings open and fully textured everywhere, fully hand sculpted. And you can use these just about anywhere. I enjoy using them both as doors, but also as another wall. So you can just put it on top of uh, a segment of flat floor, as I'm doing here. And that gives you a little bit more modularity with stuff. And it fits. It isn't a perfect fit no but it's good enough so it's something you can definitely do and you can see here i'm showing it with caverns deep and caverns actually those are all caverns deep pieces but i will be showing a, a small build with some caverns pieces as well so that's just something that you can look at and use but you don't have to use the all these doors just in caverns pieces from dorm forge you can use them with other terrain as well that you might have some of these are great for standalone, and it's just it's a really neat and a cool thing that you can do here uh, to kind of add a little extra flavor to your gaming. You might not be aware, but you can actually pop the doors out of the cave doors that swing, so you can pop those out and you can put a different door piece in as well. And I'm not sure I'm right at this moment, uh, because when <laughs> Darren Film and I put the piece in a separate spot, but... I'll show you a photo of it near the end of this video. Uh, there is actually uh, a floor piece that has a trap door set in it, so you can remove the trap door or put it back in. It's a really nice way to maybe hide a little uh, treasure or something cool for people to get at. It's just it's a neat thing. But you can see here I'm showing all sorts of ways that you can use these pieces both within the doors or separately. Uh, and just a word of caution, the portocollis is very sharp. So be sure to get these from dwarvenforge.com.